Hi, I'm Aries. I'm a non-binary trans person. I'm pansexual and my pronouns are they, them. I'm one of the exec of Warwick Tabletop Games and Roleplaying Society and one of the main organisers of Tabletop Radio. Warwick Tabletop is one big amalgamation of all things tabletop gaming. We're talking war games like Warhammer and X-Wing, board games, card games like Magic the Gathering and Netrunner, RPGs like Dungeons and Dragons, and live action roleplay. We're this wonderful little community of like-minded people drawn together by this love for tabletop gaming. But we've also become a strong community of LGBTQIA plus folks and enthusiastic allies, which is amazing. I didn't join Tabletop specifically looking for a queer community. I didn't join knowing or expecting one to be there, but it's definitely one of the big reasons I'm now so devoted. I joined the exec a few years ago as secretary because I love organising stuff, but since then I've found myself doing an incredible amount of LGBTQIA plus centred fundraising and education because there was the support and enthusiasm for it. It has really kick-started my queer advocacy journey. I feel so blessed when people come to chat to me specifically about queer topics. Hi, I'm Finbar, this year's society president, general mess and non-binary person. I joined Tabletop back in the first week of my first year due to my existing love of board games from Sixth Form, and love the people and welcoming me in atmosphere so much that I've stuck around for the last four years. Which is such a long time. Over these years, the society has cultivated such an accepting environment that's allowed me and many others to be proud of who they are and not afraid to show it which makes helping run it incredibly rewarding. We've done a lot of impressive stuff as a society, and I've enjoyed every minute of it. Having this little community is one of the reasons we choose our fundraising efforts to go to LGBTQIA plus charities. We ourselves are queer, and we want to support our queer friends and community. But sadly, charity fundraising has suffered greatly due to the COVID-19 pandemic. And our usual in-person charity fundraising that we would be doing about now during our annual Tabletop Society Pride Week can no longer happen. So instead, we're participating in the 2.6 Challenge, a drive to help out UK charities. We wanted something to bring together our community in this isolated time. And we wanted something that echoed the marathon aspect of our Tabletop Weekends. And so we settled on an epic 26-hour charity stream to tie into the 2.6 theme, with a lot of segments incorporating activities that we and the people in our community love. We're raising money for Stonewall, an LGBT-focused charity that is committed to empowering LGBT individuals, transforming the culture of institutions towards inclusivity and acceptance, changing hearts and minds to value and respect LGBT individuals, and changing and protecting laws that contribute to LGBT equality. Their work is especially important in a time when LGBT people may be stuck isolating with unaccepting families, or when government officials try to slip anti-LGBT legislation through while not many people are paying attention. So, if you're able to donate, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. It means the world, and if you're watching the stream, we hope you enjoy. Oh, hello there. Why? Thank you for sticking around this long. For anyone who's still listening, um, we're going to be taking it down a little bit, not uh, a little bit. Um, it is now getting close to half past eleven. Um, it's late. It's late. I'm tired. We've been doing this for what has almost been twenty-five hours. We have. Got an hour and a half left to go. This is where things get wacky um, because next up is Jackbox. Jackbox games with a few of us on Tabletop Sock. Um, we're going to be doing that until 1 a.m. Hopefully, um, it's going to be it's going to be good. It's going to be good. Um, I think seeing as this is going to be the last interlude I will be doing, other than perhaps, other than perhaps, um, a quick ending goodbye, um, I will just go off and uh, thank some of the, the supporters of this, this wacky stream that we've been doing so far. Um, 
it's been it's been great it has been great honestly um I'm, I'm just gonna go through and i'm gonna read them off thank you anonymous for your five pound donation thank you john b for your 20 and your five pound donation thank you aries for your five pound donation thank you john c for your five pound donation your boy alex the smiley face thank you for your five pound donation benjamin thank you for your five pound donation holly hutchinson thank you for your 25 pounds oh my god benjamin again 40 pounds thank you bisexual disaster 20 pounds thank you come to laugh uh i definitely know who that is five pounds thank you james come to laugh 30 pounds wow what a what an amount soul eight pounds thank you bisexual disaster again with 40 pounds and one pence anonymous thank you pocket workshop 50 pounds astounding honestly much love to you jamie with 51 pounds it's great work guys it has been great work elliot for 52 pounds thank you dan 10 pounds nathan 25 pounds seb 10 pounds or lost 10 pounds cara 10 pounds finbar 10 pounds five pounds thank you all for those donations it's been great it's been great i've i i've loved every second of this this is it's been great fun um there is still time to donate if you want to um a reminder that the donate button is down below in the description of this this channel um You get all kinds of all kinds of goodies for donating. You could get a GBR. I think there are a couple couple spaces left to go, if you want one. Also, I mean, feel free to not kill Aries and uh, give them less less work to do. Um, nine pound pin badges. There's five pounds for a, a kazoo rendition, which probably isn't going to happen at this point. Um, other than you know it being recorded and sent to you privately. Um, I could spin the wheel, but I, I, I'm terrified of getting dancing. So, <laughs> I hope, I hope the amount of wheel spins that have occurred thus far have been worth it. Um, honestly, this has been great. We've got about four minutes to go until we're gonna get ready from Jackbox. It's gonna be good fun. Callum's gonna be leading this one because uh, he's got all the games. Um, we will be handing over to them shortly. It's gonna be good. It's gonna be good. Um, I know a few people might be joining later. We'll see if that happens. Um, I don't blame them if they want to go to bed. Um, cause yeah, I don't know about you guys, but my my bedtime is like one a.m., which is the end of the stream. I'm gonna be there. Um, who else is going to be there? We've had we've had some some organization of this very very last minute. James is going to be there. Jacob's going to be there. We might have Nathan. We might have Aries. It'll be good. It'll be good. It'll be really. It'll be chill. Um, we're not going to be doing too much. Um, those in chat. What was your favorite? What was your favorite segment? And don't say interlude because that's not a segment. Um, I know, I know, everyone loves loves the interludes. They love my beautiful face on camera. But what did you like? Tabletop and chill. Tabletop and chill was good. <laughs> Tabletop and chill was good. Uh, I, I'm not gonna lie. I got very angry at the. Uh, at the code names um <laughs> but that's beside the point um do a flirt check the rpg yeah that i i really enjoyed playing in that that was that was good fun i'm looking forward to to the next the next stream that we may be doing we may be we may be continuing that adventure i mean it's not much of an adventure um yeah um we we did have we did have a number 
we had a number in the end for, for monsters on the cruise ship. Um, we had a number of uh, oh my gods and bad jokes. The number of oh my gods were 18 and the bad jokes were 7. Which brings us to 25, which was kind of sad. I was hoping it would be 26. Um, Animal Crossing was very chill. I enjoyed Animal Crossing. Um, I don't, I don't play Animal Crossing, but it, like I said uh, in the interview afterwards, it, it's a very, it's a very chill game, very creative game. Um, aesthetic is is how I describe it. It's good fun, good fun, honestly. Um, right. Well, let, let's see if let's see if people are ready. Uh, let's, 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 at, at Callum, uh, that's not his title, there we go, uh, let me, oh god, I, I can't type, I can't type, it's too late, guys, um, minus the speed running the reviews, yes, uh, <laughs> I'm sorry if that was a bit rushed on, on your end, um, I was nagging you about halfway through, and you were like, "Oh my god, we've only we've only seen two islands," um, but that was fine. We're back on schedule now, more or less. We're back on schedule. I don't I don't know how how we managed it in the end. Um, Minecraft had its hiccup, and then it was all downhill from there. But somewhere the interlude just just tanked the hit, and and now we're on schedule. It's good. Good. Um, hopefully, we're going to get some people people ready for Jackbox. Um, not, we may have another thirty minutes of me monologuing. It's fine. This this is a this is the chill part of the streams. Um, kind of like speedrunning a house building. Yeah, um, speedrunning a movie is is good fun. I I enjoyed that you were speedrunning. Um, I can't remember their name, um, but that final that final island um, when it was it was literally them touring touring for you. Um, okay, Callum Callum is ready. Cool. Let let us let us let's get started. Just jump into it. Um, there's a few questions flying around. I'm sure that's fine. Um, I'm streaming right now. I don't need to be wrapping around right now. Yeah, this is nice. Nice and chill. Um, as you can probably tell, my, my, my curtains are now drawn. It's getting late. Uh, I think, I think you can no longer see Froge and his friends. Um, a bit far away and the camera's a bit. Yes. Go to LARP when it's reopened. Um let's not let's not spread spread the logy. Excellent. Yes, when we're not at risk of catching the deadly virus. Um <laughs> All the LARPers are, are, have come out in chat. They're, they're voicing their their problems. Honestly, LARP, LARP can be good fun. Mum to carp. Walk to lame. Home to carp. Right. Well, I think I think maybe I should jump into into the Discord with everyone. So start, start chatting a bit. Hello. Oh, hello. Oh, you're you're currently live. Um, I'm thinking we. Yeah. Oh, well, I, I'm I'm about to end my interlude segment. Just checking how things are. How are things going with people? Uh, fine, fine. I'm trying to keep quiet. 
because people yeah, need to sleep. Uh, I, I do not have the same restriction because I'm alone in my house. I mean, I might be fine. My door tends to block quite a bit of sound, surprisingly. I've had nobody complain about me being louder-ish on a night. But uh, it's fine. I, I know Ares re requested uh, Drawful, but I think that's probably going to be a bit loud. Um, we're going to start with some just, You Don't Know Jack, because that's nice and laid back and doesn't require really loads have... of shouting. Uh, yeah, and then we'll see, where, really we'll see where we go. Drawful. You don't really have to shout for Drawful, though. But there's a few options we can do that don't require loads of shouting. So Yeah, yeah I, think, I, think, I think we want to keep probably this, the best this stream a bit chill. We'll, uh... A bit chill, yeah. It's like closing yeah. up nice and chill is a good idea. Think of it as ASMR or ASM. Because I want to put in minimal effort because I'm <laughs> selling something really late. ASMR, Jason. Not quite ASMR, but we've all got our, our also, sort of jazz Also, I just realised the majority, the majority of the people in this Discord are former LARP preps or current LARP preps. Do you know what this means? A coup. <laughs> a coup. Uh, as, as Vice Secretary. I will take you. I mean, all. if war games can do it, why can't we? Because all of our weapons are see... locked away in the university, and we don't have access. See, war games hasn't done it. Yeah, war games hasn't succeeded. I'm still disappointed. I'm still disappointed that my. Uh, well, then again, not so much because Empire's not on. Therefore, I don't need to worry about not being able to access my staff. Excellent. Brian yeah. said, "Is though it's on the way, so if." An Empire event does come up, I might be able to attempt to swing by and pick right, up Callum, my staff. I think if, if we're ready to get going, I'm going to end the stream. So you can start. Yeah, that's fine. Ooh. Right. Is everyone who wanted to play Jackbox yes, here I so. right now? I mean, I'm here. Yeah. Yeah. I think we are, because I'm not going to bother hiding the room code, because cool. I can't be bothered, basically. Uh, so just jump on it. I'm like the stream quick. now.